Hello everybody. In this video, I will show you how to connect your SAP user ID, your user account with the HR master data record. For this, I'm in a SAP system with a HCM module installed. HCM stands for Human Capital Management. And in this module, there are some information about the person or the organization assignment stored. For this, I created uh, two windows. First, with the transaction PA30 the, to maintain the HR master data. And second, the window on the left side with the transaction SU01 it's the user maintenance. I start with the user maintenance. There is the information stored to your SAP account, to your SAP ID. So I type in my username, go to display, and then we see some information about the address. You see my email address. There are informations about parameters, roles, logon data, and so on. The left window is the data about my HR information. I type here my personal number, click on enter, and you can see there are some information about my name, my group, my uh, assignment, my contract, and my organization. Additionally, you have information about my personal data, address, payslip, and so on. And if I want to connect these two records, I have to add or I have to open a special info type. It's called 105. I type this in the info type input field. This info type is called communication. And I create a new one. Then I have to uh, pick the subtype. We start with the CU name. This is my username, the name of my user ID. Double click on this record. Then I have uh, to copy and paste my username here. And I can additionally create a start and a to date if I want. Then I save this entry. And now we have created a communication record with the uh, system username. If I want to add uh, another information, for example, the email, I change the subtype to 10 and create a new one. Then I copy my email and paste this in this input field. Then I save this. And if I want to see my stored communication records, I delete the subtype. Then I go to the icon overview and click on it. And here you can see our two new records. First, the CU name, the user ID, and second, the email address. And this information is stored in a table, so you can use this in reports or programs. We open the transaction SE11 for the upper dictionary. And the database table is called PA and the name of the info type. Always four digits, in our case 0105. And now we look at our records. We type in my personal number and click on search. Then we see the entries, the personal number, the subtype and the data, user ID, and the email address. Okay, 
Yes, that was it already. Don't forget to subscribe my channel. I would be happy if you if we see us again in some of my next videos. Thank you and goodbye.